Does everybody know what time it is? Tools That's right, Bimfer Tools is proud to present Space Rogue. That's right, it's tool time again. Lots of small updates this week on Packet Storm. We told you about the Packet Fence on Tool Time before. It's a network access control system that not only free, but proven industrial strength. Well, Packet Fence has been updated to support more switches, better performance, better documentation, and new DHCP fingerprints. They're all, they're all, they're all, they've also made more capabilities GUI accessible. 1.9.1 is actually a fairly major release. iExploder has been updated to add a second redirect for confirming crash conditions in order to duplicate page transition crashes. It also fixes a bug that broke subtest isolation when running tests in random order. iScanner is a free open source tool written in Ruby that lets you detect and remove malicious code from web pages. This release includes bug fixes and an update to the signatures database. These are all available at PacketStorm today. We have a few other tools to tell you about too. Lens version 1.3.0.0 now has support for the padding oracle attack. Not that it's all that complicated since you can tell with no more than a web browser in your eyeballs, but it's nice to have the various checks packaged up into a tool. Bindiff 3.2.0 is out. So what are the new features in Zynamics Bindiff 3.2.0? In a nutshell, besides many bug fixes and a better IDA integration, the quality of the diff engine has been improved. Also, this version is shipped with a new C++ based exporter plugin for IDA, which unifies the export process between bin navi and bin diff. Blue Log is a very simple Bluetooth scanner written to do a single task log devices that are in discoverable mode. It's intended to be used as a site survey tool, determining how many discoverable Bluetooth devices there are in a given environment. Havij helps testers find and exploit SQL injections in a web page. It can fingerprint the backend database, retrieve users, password hashes, schema and data from the database, run SQL, access the file system, execute OS commands, and the commercial version can even enable all those sprocks the security guys like to turn off. The version 1.12 release has more fixes and new features than we can list from itsecteam.com. itsecuritylab.eu has another fairly high-end SQL injection tool. Blind Cat was released last week, and like Havij, it has too many features to list. Suffice it to say that between the two, whether support for HTTPS, POST, proxies, particularly complicated payloads, or whatever, you're covered. WS Fuzzer is a fuzzing penetration testing tool written in Python used against HTTP SOAP-based web services. It tests numerous aspects, input validation, XML parser, etc., of the SOAP target, we mention this to point out that it does still require a WIST dual file, which makes it useless in most cases. Oh, and it has some stupid warnings about only being used to test targets you have permission to test. That's it for this week's Tool Time. Join us next week for our salute to Tool Time.